Hey guys, Rex Elbray here with Action Ad, and today we've got a quick overview of the Do It Yourself Kit by Action Ad. So the Do It Yourself Kit comes with all the hardware we use in our Action Hats, and it lets you turn any hat into an Action Hat. All right, so in this video, we're going to go over our installation on a standard hat with no logo in the front, and then we'll go over all the different ways you can also install it, depending on the hat type you have. Alright, for the standard installation, you want to have it about two inches up from the hat bill. So what you'll do is you'll use this aluminum mount as a template, get it nice and centered where you want it, and go ahead and mark. Alright, so we've got the marks there. And all I'll do is take a blade, and then I'll punch right through it. And I actually like to do a couple punches, one horizontal and one vertical. And all these holes are for are to put the screws through, and we'll, we'll go ahead and do that right now. All right, and then you just tuck the frame right in. You see the holes we made there? We're going to push these screws through. And the aluminum mount is actually threaded, so you don't need any nuts on the other side. Then I'll go back in and tighten them both up nice and securely. And it's on there. Pretty easy. So the standard install tucks right into the hat brim right here. But if you have a hat with a logo on it, like this one, you don't necessarily want to put holes right through the logo. So on this hat here, what we did is we went right above this logo area and you'll see it doesn't necessarily have to tuck in all the way so here we went a little bit higher and then just adjusted the frame accordingly now the key thing is this frame can literally go anywhere inside this hat the only thing that really matters is how it's going to fit when you put it on your head so again if you're not able to put it in the standard location my recommendation is to figure out where on the hat you want to put it place the frame a few different ways, and then try it out. See how it fits. See how it looks. All right, so here's another hat with a logo right where the standard location would be. So on this one, you'll see we actually flipped it around because it actually fits better that way. And again, it's always gonna depend on what hat you're using and the shape of your head. So the do-it-yourself action hat kit really gives you the flexibility to set up this hat exactly how you need it. And then here's another custom action hat. This one, we got one of those hats with the, with the LEDs on it. And then check out this beast here. This is my, actually my night fishing setup. We got a Neo Petzl headlamp. Got the GoPro on the double mount. So we've mounted it to the back on this one. And mounting it to the back, lets me shoot at night without the hat bill getting in the way and then I have another mount where I just attach the battery pack and of course this is super super heavy so on this one we actually use two frames or one and a half frames so this is the full frame now on this one we just cut out one of the mounts so it fits better and the reason we put two frames in here is because this is obviously a very, very heavy setup. So with these two frames, it actually floats this. So now I can go out and fish at night and film it without worrying about this whole setup falling into the water where I'll never find it again. This frame is gonna float most hats, but obviously we can't guarantee it. So what we recommend is always float testing your action hat setup. And last, for those that don't need their action hat to float, 
you could simply cut and trim this frame as needed. In fact, once you cut it, all you need is another aluminum mount and you could actually create two custom action hats. All right guys, so that's it. Super easy install. Every do-it-yourself action hat kit comes with all the instructions. And if you have any more questions or need any more information, just check us out on actionhat.com.